Let's go! Nice one. I've got to be the best pirate you've ever seen. So it would seem. Almost there. Stay sharp. You still have two more courses. So, I heard you're trying to beat my time. Well, I can promise you won't win with your shoddy tech. Actually, I will win with my tech. And unlike you, you little corporate sellout, I don't need to cheat. Uh, Wrench? Isn't that car-stopping hack kind of like cheating? What? <laughs> no. <laughs> Shut up, Jordy. You can't let this guy win. You need to pick up the pace. I know, I know. I hope you're ready for this drone course. Won't be easy. Well, Raz isn't the only one with tricks up their sleeves. And away we go! You'll never beat me in this drone race. My time was flawless. Good fucking luck, nerd. Thanks, but I don't need your luck. You don't need luck, but you need it to overclock your drone. That seems a lot like cheating, Wrench. Shut up, Jordy! And anyway, this fucker cheated, so doesn't that make this more fair? This is the home stretch. Keep it up. Don't fail me now, little drone. There it is. That's the finish line. You can make it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Looks like someone's gonna get in trouble with Daddy Rags. Oh, shitting hell. Another contract fulfilled. Fuck yes. And it was an easy one, too. Was it easy? You had to cheat to win. Yes, it was easy. And anyway, it was just some minor rule bending. I had no choice, okay? <laughs> well, now your name will be in the ultimate, extreme, mega insanity, elite, hackathon hall of fame. Congratulations. Yes, free space bolt power drinks for life. All right, Ratchet, there's the job. It's Wrench, Wrench. <laughs> You're doing this on purpose to antagonize me. Wait a minute. Are you flirting with me, Jordy? Gonna ignore that. Job is simple, so even you'll find it hard to screw up. Client wants you to steal a car. I'm sending you the coordinates. Ew. pass. That's boring. Sorry, Mike Wrench, but the client specifically asked for you. And, oh yeah, they, uh, they're gonna tag along on the job, too. What? Uh, I'm not some glorified babysitter. 
Uh, they paid a ludicrous amount of crypto to ensure that today you are, so get to it. Wait, who's asking for me? Is it a trap? Jordy? Jordy! Digital secrets exposed. GBB for more on this developing story. Participate in whatever deep throat fantasy you're acting out of here, dude. Deep what? That's gross, man. No, it's it's an X-Files thing. I... You're gross. Whatever you say. The car I want you to steal should be nearby. Who the fuck are you? And why are you using a voice modulator? Ask the guy who's also using a voice modulator. Get the car, and maybe you'll find out. God, it's making my eyes bleed. I love it. Long times of the night, had no hair on the chin chin chins, made sure the wolves and pigs are inside. Dark. Man, defend my rights. How's the record it? Wait a minute. That music? This car? Are you? Oh my god. Tell me. You can't be. You know it, baby. It's the epic wrench and Marcus crossover the people have been asking for. Marcus? Marcus! Ah, oh, shit. That's almost better than what I thought. Wait, who the fuck did you think I was? I won't lie. I was kind of hoping you were Jimmy Siska. <laughs> no, but I do have a surprise plan for you in that vein. This car is the car Jimmy Siska drives in the upcoming Devin Von Devin movie. Devin v. Devin, London Culling. Oh my god! Is Jimmy Siska gonna jump out of the truck? No, Reggie, you're killing me here. Drive to these coordinates and I'll fill you in. Alright, so first off, you going AWOL without a word to your boy was rude. You're gonna apologize to me later for making me worry about your stupid ass. Yes, Mom. Now, tell me what my surprise is. Please, please, please! So remember when that teaser for Devin v. Devin London Culling dropped? Finally, Devin Von Devin was gonna return to our screens! Facing off against his evil British clone, Devin Van Devin, in an epic showdown of Devins. Yeah, but after the London bombings, filming got shut down and he couldn't finish the movie. Yeah, they were missing a few big stunts. But the car and all the sets are still here! Oh my god! You don't mean... It's up to us. We're gonna film those stunts and finish the movie. Fuck yeah, we are! In just three short years... In a world in need of a hero, one man stands in the way of humanity's destruction. Jimmy Siska returns as Devin Vaughn Devin. I am back, baby. In his directorial debut, Siska brings Devin Von Devin to the merry streets of England, where he faces off against his greatest adversary. Oh, I think you're seeing. 
double. His claw, secretly grown from his DNA by the sinister spy agency Elite Shadow Force. Devin Van Devin. How can I defeat myself? Huh. The epic showdown is coming soon in Devin V. Devin, London Calling. Oh, shit! That sounds so good! I am a half mast. what we're about to do here? I see a ramp. I see a car. And if the answer isn't, we're gonna jump a car. I am never speaking to you again. Hell yeah, we're gonna jump a fucking car. yippee ki motherfucker! Yeah, I got a nice angle on that, too. That, uh, that, that, that car's not insanely expensive or anything, right? I'm sure it'll buff out. We've got some more shots to do. Let's roll. Ranch and his BFF Marcus Going to blow stuff up, yeah, yeah Going to Cyber 2 Driver Gonna be friends with Jimmy's Disco Okay, it's Wrench again, huh? So how did you know I was in London? Just because you stopped talking to everybody doesn't mean I didn't keep tabs on you After you split with He who must not be named And can fall down well Yeah, touchy subject, I know I won't put you on blast for it, just are you all right? What are you doing here? I hadn't finished business with Rampart. Remember that asshole? But right now, I'm gonna blow some stuff up and live out my Devin Von Devin fan fiction, and it's gonna be so epic. Hey, he's back. Let's light it up. Okay, this is the part of the movie where Devin clashes with Devin in their first big action set piece. A showdown of epic proportions. I can do a bigger boom. Let me have fireworks, please. Hey, you gotta run through and arm all the explosives that are set up. You need to be fast, though. If you take too long, they'll automatically disarm as a safety precaution. Speed run!
I got it! Marcus, hit it! Oh, that's so beautiful. I just came a little. Every time I think I'm used to you. Okay, I want star wipes on this, Marcus. We're making art here. Coming soon in the next chapter of the Devon Von Devon saga. You're not the man I thought you were, Devon. That's because it wasn't me. It was Devon, my evil clone. He hasn't been using my fingerprints to fool the scanner. He has my fingerprints. He is me. Face it, Devon. You're being replaced by a superior version. I don't think so. Nothing beats American made. Hey man, do you think there's a chance that Devin v. Devin, London Culling, could end with Devin Von Devin losing? What? No way. There is literally nothing that can take Devin Von Devin down. Except for himself? Huh? Why else did they clone him? Who wins in a death match between Jimmy Siska and Jimmy Siska? It's, it's an impossible riddle. But his clone is not the same as him. It's not actually Devin versus himself. It's like Alien versus Predator. You know who's going to win. Oh, fuck, not this again. The Xenomorph has acid blood, Marcus. It melts through the Predator's armor. Nah, fuck you. The Predator has a stealth cloak and thermal vision and fucking rocket launchers. The Predator is the greatest hunter in the galaxy. This is my more than just big game. I am turning this car around, young man. Oh shit, where did our dark Cylons come from? The Rampart boss. And how do I get this guy off my ass? Well, they look angry and armed. Hey, let's get out of here. Maybe we can find a different place to set up. No way. I'm not letting Rampart take Devin Von Devin away from me, too. The show must go on. I love the smell of burning carbon fiber in the morning. Creator, why did you build me to feel pain? Woohoo! That's the money shot. Aw, oh, I guess there are robots in Devin V. Devin now. Hell yeah, dude. This is like a punch up to the script. Maybe we'll get writing credits for improving the third act. <laughs> you know, I can see us looking fresh as hell on the red carpet premiere. Oh, Jim, let's... Perfect. I got all the footage we needed. I'm gonna cut this together and send it to Jimmy Siska's crew. And you'll add Star Wipes? And a Benga soundtrack. I got you, Reggie. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wrench. Ah, uh, you can get away with it. You coming home soon? Um, maybe. I've still got to do some stuff here. All right. Well, when you get your scrawny ass back to San Fran, hit me up. Everybody's been waiting to do a full crew hangout on the beach. Now, I won't lie. Sitar might want to chew your ear off for a bit. But it's with love, right? You know, that does sound nice. Thanks, man. You're buying, though. <laughs> Am I? Yeah, just hurry up over there, all right? And once we get this movie out the door, you better not watch the new trailer without me. Mark it in your calendar. You, me, Devin, and Devin. I love you, man. I know.
If I was a multimillionaire, I'd have a nice crib too. Wait, is she a billionaire? Greetings, Reginald Blackman. Ah, Jesus! Sky Larson is in the sitting room. Your fucking house knows my name? I need you to pay attention, Mr. Blackman. It's Wrench. I know you have the broker bridge. Uh, moi? <laughs> okay, no, you're right. I am holding on to it. But just for safekeeping, Scout's honor. Hmm. Because of your recent spat, Thomas Rempart has decided that if he can't have the broker bridge, he'll go right to the direct source. He's taken my deep labs hostage. I need you to clear out his forces and give me control of my labs back. Okay, I'm not even gonna get into how creepy it is that you know all this shit, but you said you could help Aiden? If you secure my labs, I'll help you revive Aiden Pierce from his coma. How? Do you know what the deep labs were built for? Why they're kept a secret? Bring the broker bridge to the labs, and I'll show you what it can really do. was flirting with me, and two, you get the feeling we're jumping into a shitstorm here? Yeah, but this is what we gotta do to help Aiden. Why are you still risking your neck to help him, even though he's done bad by you? Because everybody deserves a chance to set things right, even after they fuck up. Like, I'm sure no matter how mad he is at you, your buddy in San Francisco wants you to call him back. Whoa, th what? Th hey, did you read my diary? No. Dude, you play those voicemails from Marcus all the time. On speaker. Just call him back. Trust me. Oh, okay. Uh, shut up! Sky said we needed to bring the broker bridge. She must not know you blew it up. What do we do? <laughs> yeah, about that. Get ready for me to blow your mind. Broker Bridge? The other one was a fake? Fake Broker Bridge, real bomb. I stashed this one where no one could ever find it. In the Postal Service. Been in limbo circuiting the city this whole time. Nice. All right, let's get it to Broker Tech. gone through a rebranding. Rempart's got his goons all over the place. You'll have to get through them to find a way inside. Don't worry. I'm wearing my ass-kicking pants today.
booting up shop. Ready ultrasonic blast. I've moved on to better. And just like his car, I'm gonna fuck up your shit with a sledgehammer. exactly what I came here for. And your reckoning is coming. But for now, I can be patient. Next time I see you, I'm gonna peel the skin off your face. Slowly. Well, ladies and gentlemen and all other fine folk, with that, Monsieur Rempart has left the building. Excellent. Aiden Pierce is being transported here as we speak. You will need to reactivate the command system so I have access. There. You should be back in. Then we can begin. Come on, big guy. Gentlemen, shall we begin? You have the broker bridge. The system requires two users. The pilot who uses the broker bridge and the subject who is connected to the reader. This will allow you to interface with Aiden's mind. It will scan his brain and create a visual projection that you can engage with. And that's how I'll be able to revive him? Well, the hope is that you'll be able to communicate with him and perhaps identify or repair any damage. How long does this usually take? I'm eager to find out. What, wait, what, you, you mean you've never done this before? This 
is the first human trial. The most exciting phase of the project. God damn it, you fucking lied to us! You never cared about taking Rump out of your labs. You just want us here to be your fucking guinea pigs. Semantics. Jackson, this is insane. Hey, there is no guarantee this is gonna wake up Aiden. I, I, I say we, we grab him, we, we get the fuck out of here, and we'll find a better way. There isn't a better way. I have to do it. You could wind up in a coma too, or worse. Everyone deserves a chance. Oh my god, that sounds so incredibly profound. What the fuck does that even mean? It means I'm going in. For Aiden.